Hello soulmates and welcome back to our channel. We are Soulmates Broadcast. I'm Abby and I'm Claudia and we are going to be taking you guys on a tour of Vancouver mm -hmm. and all the restaurants that you need to visit while you are here. tour here in Vancouver and we are at the Trattoria and Trattoria actually we have to look it up I won't lie um, it actually means a place that is less formal than a restaurante however more formal than an osteria so it's kind of an in-between in terms of Italian dining this place has just looking at the menu amazing dishes it has an amazing patio um, and incredible like views inside you can sit by the window you can sit by the kitchen we have an open kitchen which is great so we're really really excited to try out the food we're gonna start with some appies, some drinks, and then move into food and dessert. So we are super excited to get started with our tasting of everything. And the first thing that we're gonna try is the drinks. Um, so what they brought us out here, the first thing is, is the Trattoria Spritzer. Then over here we have the white wine sangria, and we have a strawberry basil drink. So we're super excited to try these and to eat the food.
crunchy on the outside, soft on the inside, and I really like the sauce that they talked to it. They found it really played into the flavors really well. Um, the vegan ramen that I had was absolutely delicious, really good play of veggies, the tomato base of whatever the hell of the ramen was really, really good. I, I really liked it. Um, and then this one here, which is the most popular dish that they sell, um, this one has a really, really distinct flavor. We really liked it. It's very unique. Um, and the noodles were cooked absolutely perfectly. We definitely recommend this dish if you're coming to check out this restaurant. Also, note that it does come with an additional side of rice to it. So you get a lot of food, which is awesome. Hey, so nice. Morning. <laughs> so we are here to get our coffee fix for the day because we have a long day ahead of us packed with exciting things. Um, so obviously we need caffeine for that. So we're going to Elysian Coffee um, to try their menu and their variety of drinks. by having dinner at Tacofino Ocho Mexican Restaurant. Tacofino owns several restaurants throughout Vancouver and they are all different. This one in particular has a focus on family and family sharing plates. We started off by ordering an agua fresca margarita and a mortar hotel. As an appetizer, we were recommended to try their esquites dish, which is charred corn in a chipotle mayo sauce. We can see why they insisted we try this. It was seriously to die for. We ordered a variety of tacos including the grilled chicken, sweet potato and leek, crispy cod, and grilled squid. Our favorite was the sweet potato and leek due to its uniqueness and flavor. We finished off our meal with their rice pudding and churros. to our next coffee stop right now. It's gonna be Grounds for Coffee mm -hmm. that we are headed to, not too far from where we were staying downtown. So we're gonna go check it out, learn a little bit about what they do and what they offer. And get some coffee to yes. start our day. why this is a must off one of the best here in Vancouver and it's because they claim to have the best cinnamon buns in the entire world so we are super excited to try those but to also try the variety of drinks that they have because they do have quite a large menu so if you're picky with your coffee or like um, to try different things this is definitely a place you should consider next time that you're in the city
buns for coffee, tried out the cinnamon buns, tried out a coffee, tried out a frozen drink. You would have seen all that footage. Um, and I, I thought it was incredible. Their slogan is probably the best cinnamon buns in the world. And I absolutely agree. But without the probably, I think they are so, they're definitely some of the best cinnamon buns we have ever had. They were just so soft. They were so soft. Yeah. I loved that they weren't overly sweet. Mm -hmm. I think that was the biggest thing is that we, we could eat the whole cinnamon bun. They're pretty big size cinnamon buns. And yeah. we could eat the whole thing and we didn't feel like we had just eaten, you know, a ton of sugar and then we just felt kind of icky afterwards. So like I definitely recommend I would totally eat that for breakfast. Yeah. Oh I mean so, we did. Uh, oh we did eat for <laughs> <laughs> Look yeah. at that, like living proof. Yeah. Amazing. So we just wrapped all of that up. We we're actually headed to the Flyover Canada um, today, which is an attraction pretty much downtown Vancouver. And we'll include that in our Vancouver vlog. So if you guys want to check that out, we will link it in the description box for you guys. Um, but that will all be included in that. So that is where we headed next. And then after that, I think more food. Perfect. Out. Okay, so mate, so we're gonna go to our last food place here in Vancouver. And again, we're in Gastown because the best restaurants are here and we're gonna be going to Water Street Cafe, um, which is like a casual kind of brunch environment for this time of day. Right on um, Water Street. Yeah, Shocker. so we're close to the, <laughs> to the water. Yeah. Um, so let's go check out their menu. of the mushroom flavor. 